Hi friends, welcome to my channel Civil Guru 04. Today we have exercise number 5 for chapter number 6 that how to create a station offset labels on any alignment. Sometimes we have alignments for road but we have not labeled there for any structure near the alignment or we want to add label on alignment of any uh, station and offset. So in this video we will exercise that how to add uh, station and offset label for any area. So before starting kindly subscribe my youtube channel Civil Guru 04 here you can learn AutoCAD Civil 3D and land surveying also. You can also access me through my Facebook page Land Developer and Architect Designer. You can share here your issues about land development and uh, Civil 3D. So let's start our exercise number 5 how to create a uh, station offset label. mentioned earlier uh, in the previous exercise an alignment is often used uh, base, as a baseline enabling other features to express their location in relation to that baseline. This is typically uh, done with station of certain notations and uh, of course the AutoCAD Civil 3 program provides you uh, with labels to do just that. This type of label is referred to as a station offset level. Unlike the label group you learned about earlier in the previous exercise, station offset level stand alone instead of uh, being part of set. They are capable of uh, reporting the station and offset of a point that you select as well as the alignment name, coordinate of the point and uh, other types of information. You can create a station offset label as either fixed or floating label. If they are fixed, they then they hold their positions and update the station and offset value when the alignment is edited. If they are floating, then they maintain the station and offset value and move with the alignment when it is edited like spot elevation level, station offset level and uh, paired with a marker. So in this exercise uh, we will add station labels to all define the road geometry and uh, intersection of the Jordan Court and Madison Lane. Please take your notebook and write down all the step one by one. Step number one, open the drawing name station offset label. You can locate this drawing in the description of this video and I will put my all social media, uh, my pages, my Facebook ID, Instagram. Uh, you can access me through uh, them. So. Step number two, I have already opened this drawing. When you will open, you can see we have our real time project which we are going through step by step. Step number two, click the Jordan Court alignment. Here we have Jordan Court alignment, and when we click, it will show contextual tab. Here you can see add label, click and then select station offset fixed point. Step number 3. While holding down the shift key, right click and then select end point. So now you can select any end point with this transparent command actually. Step number 4. Click the northern end of the northern arc. Here we have northern arc and northern end of arc we have here. 
when you will hover your cursor here it will select end point for you <coughs> so click here and you can see a new label that reference uh, the Jordan court alignment is created at the location so step number five while holding down the shift key and then press end point again and select click the southern end of the southern arc here we have another arc and we have end point here click you can see it show the level press is Step. step number six press escape twice to end the command clear the selection of the alignment now click the medicine alignment medicine lane alignment then add label station offset fixed point click step number seven while holding down shift key select end point click the western end of the northern arc here we have one arc and we need to select here click here actually step number nine press escape sorry step number eight while holding down shift key then right click and select end point then click the western end of the southern arc you can see here press escape twice to end the labeling command and clear the selection of alignment click one of the label step number 10 and then click the square grip and drag it to the new location that is clear of other line and text repeat this step uh, for the other label to improve their appearance and readability on the drawing which we have already learned in previous chapter that how can we uh, use our grips so in this method we can show any station or offset label on any uh, alignment for example we have our exercise has been end but i want to show you something more that if we have any other structure here inside the inside or outside of the road for example we have here a little manhole i am marking a circle and we want to check this manhole center is how much offset of left or right and how much the station of this manhole so how can we do that select alignment add label go with this station offset fixed point then press shift key right click of mouse and then select end point uh, sorry now we have circle we will select midpoint so you can see it's selecting midpoint for us click in the mid of circle and press escape twice now you can see it's showing that alignment is medicine and we are on the 0 plus 109.35 in a station and in offset we have 4.61 meter l far left we are going from here so it's our left side of the alignment so you can see we how can we use create a station offset label step number 11 save and close your drawing hope you like this video if you like kindly subscribe and press press the bell icon to get latest notification about
favorite 3D and land surveying videos. Thank you. Goodbye.